Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new WWE Supergirl video. This is episode 135. Oh, team event is right now. Five hours left in the team event, guys. Again, the race is on. We are going to be making change at the end of this event. Uh, because it's just not going to be... Po we can't keep doing this. We can't keep coming down to the last. I don't think we're going to do it. It requires a lot of grinding. I mean, we've got five hours and seven minutes left. It's not looking good. I would like to sh first of all start the video with a huge shout out to, to Fatboy, aka Apex, in the team. You've done an awesome grind, man. Um, you've definitely you, you've definitely been doing really well ever since we kind of ever since I started this team. So, yeah, good job, man. D2 putting a good shift in there. Uh, thank you, everyone. Like the Beast, you put in a really good shift. So Ra started off really strong, uh, and then probably just like me, uh, you know, going you know after going. To sleep and shit and work or more you in your case so yeah that that's all you know but put in a massive shift that's important flame flame come on man come on come on flame uh everyone below like like f like yeah flame vzh ollie jamie and franklin oh needs to be more points by now definitely need to be more points by now um if if we're gonna each get 420 i mean it, i know it's a big shift i know but uh, we're gonna we're gonna really really have to put in these shifts for these team events. So we're just gonna get straight into it. Um, plus tens. Let's do this. I've got no credits left, but um, can't add some can't add some either. So I'll be I'll be grinding. I'll be grinding for the next hopefully five hours. I want to get this Bobby Roode card for everyone in the team. So uh, yeah, we we gotta do this. We gotta do this. All right. That Matt Hardy scared me at first, but. Uh, Okay, thank God we're not coming up against or or amazing. Okay, still there are still elite singles in here. That's good. That's good. At least the games aren't gonna get too hard. We should be able to obviously plus ten now. That's no problem. The question is, it's the time. You know, twenty four hours isn't a lot of time. I really think they should extend it to twelve hours. Sorry, to to twenty four hour well, one day and twelve hours like they they used to. But um, that would be much better. Maybe not for Team Ring Dom, but definitely for Team RTG. It's a lot of points to get if you think of it. I mean, that is four. That is um, that's forty-two. That's forty-two games. Forty-two games of RTG. If you use credits, all right, that in twenty-four hours. And if you don't, that's like eighty-eight. So um, wait, did I count that right? Did I? What did I say? Forty-two? No, not not forty-eight. Not eighty-eight. Eighty-four. Um, but that's, that's a lot of games in 24 hours, especially if you are either younger and maybe you can't be on your phone all the time because of your parents or like you've got school and people right with jobs. It's, it is definitely a big, big ask. Um, but yeah, so they definitely should extend the time, like 24 hours. You know, a lot, a lot can happen in 24 hours. I mean, you do need to do stuff, you know, you can't, I know, but whatever. Whatever, and it's not like a free player can just sit down after school for like three hours and just do it. No, because you have to wait for bouts as well, which is a big, a big, a quite, quite an annoying problem for a lot of free players. I mean, I know the ad glitch has uh, has kind of changed that all a bit, but it's still if you do the ad glitch, it takes uh, you know it's it's a long time to have to you know wait. Every, you do your bouts, then you have to watch a video thirty seconds. Play your bow, watch another video for 30 seconds, then do that like three or four or five times. Then you have to go re. And then, and then it all takes time, so it is very time consuming no matter what you do. So, obviously, credits does speed it up a little bit, but not everyone can use credits in the events. But let me know what you guys think about this whole Team RTG. Is 24 hours long enough to give the teams a good enough chance sometimes to get those cards? I'm not saying that every team struggles, I know some teams don't. Um, but that's not everyone, you know, that isn't everyone. Obviously, if you have insane grinders on all the teams who really put in a shift, then yeah, but yeah, you guys see what I'm trying, you see what I say, you guys get it. But anyway, I've also got a King of the Ring under, under, underway. Um, it's a bit more than underway because we're currently in the quarterfinals, but I'm going to show it to you guys. I'm a bit scared we're going to get quarter bumped here, but uh, hopefully... Hopefully we can get a bit lucky and go through, and we don't. We've lost the first two. No, we've lost the first game. Okay, we've lost the first game, but that's because I wasn't fully energized. So we're gonna have a shot at this. Hopefully, hopefully we can get the win 
in the next two games, which will take us to the semi-finals. Obviously, we want to make it to the finals, but I've already beaten Jamie in uh, in, in just the normal matches at the beginning, and um, he was as well. We were at the same level of energy. Uh, we, we, we played a game, didn't energise, and then we faced off. So we were both at the same level, and I managed to beat him. So that means I can beat him again. Of course, he can. Uh, at these stages in King of the Rings, it's very 50-50. Uh, between what event card procs, what event card doesn't. So it really is going to be coming down to just pure luck uh, at these stages in this King of the Ring. But hopefully with a little bit of luck, we can make it, but it's not looking great. We've got a fusion as well to claim. It is an ultra rare fusion, so really no one cares too much about this. But let's go and see who we get. I don't even know who are in the ultra rare fusions. We get Sergeant Slaughter himself let's get straight into an epic fusion F put him in we're gonna see if we have any we don't have any good cards there do we have any good enhancements like a legendary or we have none of that so we'll wait a little bit before we get our epic fusion on the way let's get back into some more team rtg let's get some points and let's pray we can get this bobby rude card um, it's not a pro for me, it is a pro for, um, sorry, not for Flame, for Fatboy, so that would be really helpful for him. Um, and it's just going to be a good card for everyone to have, you know, it's a really good card in the tier itself. It's, it's like, in, in the, like, the, like, not, it's not in the, it's not bad, it's not in the mid tier. I would say it's like at the bottom of the, the good, like, the first kind of bunch, you know, like the, it's not obviously in the top five, but it's in that kind of region, like seven, eighth, you know, like, so it's a, it is a good card. It's a card you can definitely pull off the board. Um, you know, it's just one of those cards, that, you know, you never know when your people's going to arrive in there. Boom, a Bobby Roode. So if that happens, I want everyone in the team to be able to have that Bobby Roode. It's another card for me done in the catalog, as I've been mentioning uh, in the past couple of videos. I'm not actually... Uh, I'm not far away, actually, from having at least a single of every uh, superstar in the WrestleMania catalogue, bar the, obviously the females, but I'm really not missing too much. I'm missing about seven or eight. Um, I would have, like, if we would have got that Roman in the Team RTG, I'm not going to dwell on that anymore, but if I would have, that would have, you know, been one more to add onto this list, but, um, yeah. I know, obviously, maybe some people have finished it already, but I'm just... Just saying for myself that I'm quite close, and that is uh, pretty motivating actually to to kind of get every card. You know, I uh, I definitely do enjoy the, what's, the the satisfaction of knowing that I've really like kind of finished catalogs. That's why I try and finish like the elite catalog, the ultimate catalog, and obviously I'm gonna try and do the WrestleMania catalog. When I say complete it, I don't obviously mean like. All the money in the bank cards we can pretty much say I'm going to miss out on. Like, for example, this Undertaker. Right at the beginning, I was all happy because I was like, I'm going to get this Undertaker. It's going to be easy. 24,000 contracts in money in the bank over what? The next, the next like, 30 days? That's easy to do. But no, no, it wasn't. And we're, we're failed. It's really like eight days till the next money in the bank uh, cycle. So that's not going to work out. Give me a sec, guys. All right, guys. Um, yeah, sorry about that. I, I, I had to go there and then once I came back I recorded the rest of the video and it was about a 16 minute video So like it was like literally about halfway actually eight minutes. I was like, oh, I'm just gonna go I'll be right back. Someone just entered my room. So I was like, I'm gonna stop and I uh, muted my mic and then Forgot to unmute it and then finished the rest of the video went into just editing I was like, oh, I'm gonna edit my video now Oh, why does half of this content video not have any audio on it? <sighs> so yeah, it doesn't really matter. We're just gonna give you guys a little bit of a little bit more of an episode. Then you know, I'm not gonna put I'm not gonna put any of the footage in there. Nothing really interesting happened. Just talked a little bit more about the possible update uh, coming out in the game. I'm not sure if I covered any of that in the first part. So uh, yeah, the, there's a new update coming to the game, which is fantastic. Um, I hope it's fantastic. What I really want is a new event. Um, what it could be. Now, this is me speculating. This is just me in my like fantasies in my dream. That's fantasy, not the right word. In my dreams um, is 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 a new season with a complete reset. So the only reason is I've come to be like, oh, why could it could actually be that? Now I will show you a couple things. 
One, the message with the new update, they said our, our, pro, our, our, um, our thing will be tracked, our work will be tracked or whatever, uh, not, you know, on the, on, the, on the message, on the bulletin board thing. So yeah, that is the first thing. It's like, it will be tracked. What will be tracked? Our progress, what? And then the login bonuses. So it says that you, the, login, like the login bonuses, you can't see the cards, you can't see any of that. So that got me thinking, um, like you can't see the wrestlers, but you can see the days and be like, you can like, you can see the days, you can see the numbers it takes you for the cards. But what I saw is below that, behind the number it says to like how many days you have to log in to get the card. There are obviously those colors and those colors correspond cards. It's silver, common, green, uncommon, um, light blue, rare, a bit of a darker blue, purpley kind of ish, it's super rare. Um, ultra rare is like a pinky perv, quite quite pinky, not not like a bright. Well, you you know what I mean. That's ultra rare. And then a goldy kind of orangey is the epic card. Um, and that is exactly what they've done. They've missed out like rare, um, but they the the color the color scheme fits pretty much all of it. And that can't be just a coincidence. So that got me thinking as well about could there be a new season? Could we see a complete reset in the game? Um, is it too early? I don't know. Um, they would have to figure out a really good idea because after all the money lots of people have spent on these WrestleMania packs, cards, all of that, if now it's just like, oh, that's that, that's all been for nothing, here you go, account, you're back in like rare plus plus or whatever, um, that's just not going to work out. But if they manage to figure out an idea where they can take the amount, like the deck you're in now and kind of implement that, uh, implement, did I implement, that was, wow, implement that in a, in something, some shape, form, anything, in season four, that would be really good. Maybe, um, I don't know, maybe like, you'll get rewards every, every week or every month, or better login rewards, depending on what tier you were in, uh, in, in season three, or, I, that's like that's just an example. It might be bad. You might think it's bad or something like that. Maybe like a a little bit of a boost for for the first couple of events or like for like the first um, first tier or like the first tier of the events. You know, so not of like the, it will probably start in legendary if there was a reset because legendary is how it was in uh, the beginning of season one and the beginning of season two. But uh, some something, okay. I'm just that's just me like talking. If they're gonna bring a new season, it might not be that at all. As long as Kennedy don't troll us and be like, "Hey, you're just gonna get some attitudes, and you're just gonna get, um, you know, like I don't know, throwback packs, um, those kind of things." But yeah, but yeah, yeah. But anyway, guys, that is pretty much it for me today. Um, sorry, obviously, there's a bit of that video you guys didn't get to see, but I played a little bit more. Franklin, Jamie, Ollie, Flame, VZH, please, guys, please put in a bit more of a shift. Uh, Sarah, good job. Uh, the Beast, good job. Drover, good job. Um, Fatboy, good job again, man. Really good job. I'm pretty sure I shouted you guys out the first part of the video, but yeah, good job. Everyone, talk to you guys tomorrow. Take care. Most morning, peace out.